Hello YouTube friends, welcome to Maria's Miscellany, where in this video I'm going to share with you something I had promised in a previous video. A while back I hauled this little uh, map that I picked up at a thrift store for like a dime. And the reason I bought it is because of this. It has this fold out this way on both sides. And let me back up a little bit. So I thought, oh, that is so cool. I need to figure out how to do that fold. And um, but I had it had just been sitting on my desk for a while and I hadn't really messed with it. And then um, a couple of days ago, uh, Tanya McGuire made a cute little card, which um, in which she showed us how to make a pop out heart. And that is made with a square sheet of paper. And I just happened to have this is going to be a small one, but I'll just show you the idea how easy it is. I just happened to have a block of this origami paper that um, I got a long time ago. I used to make origami. So I'll show you what she showed us. And um, it kind of will help to figure out how this works. So <laughs> even though it's tiny, the idea is you just fold your paper uh, in half both ways. Okay. And then you fold it diagonally like this uh, with the pretty side outside, I believe it is, like that. And of course, I didn't do it perfectly. You should do it perfectly so that it is, you know, per perfectly balanced. Okay, and then you open it up and pop this in. And okay, I did it the wrong way. I should have folded it this way. <laughs> okay like this okay crease it and then you pop this up and then your paper goes in like this right and and then she made a heart out of this now she drew she got a circle to you know make it a perfect circle and stuff i'm just going to um draw it i mean cut it like this because you know i like the wing stuff right and then you have a little pop-out card isn't that cute? And then I thought, oh, yes, that is how to do this. Now, I had started looking into how to do it myself. I was getting close, but look, that really helped me to figure it out. So what you do, and I'm going to use this piece of uh, four by six index card. OK, um, so in order to get this pop out map style fold, OK, you're going to fold your paper this way. Okay. And I did look up a couple of tutorials uh, on how to do this. Okay. All right. Now, the, the thing I didn't like about having to fold it the other way is that, you know, you're like here, there's no crease, right? All right. So you don't really need to put a crease on it, but you do need to know where the middle is. So I am just going to measure the middle. And should be exactly four, so it's at two inches right there. So you're gonna need to fold this towards the middle right there, okay, on both sides. So instead of that diagonal fold, you're going to fold these in towards the middle, and it should be, you know, as perfect as you can, like that, okay. And of course, this is cardstock, so it's a little bit trickier, but, and then you fold these in this way, like this. So you kind of have like a little house shape, okay? Now you're gonna wanna do this both sides or crease it both ways like this so that you can fold it easier, okay? So I'm basically just going the opposite direction just so that the creases go both ways, okay? And that's it. Then the next part is just opening it up and doing that pop thing. And look at that. Just like with the heart, the parts fold in. And then these little flaps, you just push them in like this. Push them in, push them in. And then the other side, same thing. Just push these sides in. And you have your map. You have, whoops. You have your map fold, like this. See, 
Now this has got a longer edge because of the dimensions of the paper. Um, you can cut this down to be a little bit uh, more square, but basically it works. And then you can always put this inside a card, you know, inside a regular card, glue it or whatever. And so that you can open it like that or put it in a journal, whatever you want. But um, I thought that was really cool. It was actually very easy. So I wanted to share with you guys this fold. Now, when I did look it up on YouTube, um, so they called it the Turkish map fold. <laughs> um, at least uh, if you so if you look that up, you'll find it. But I'll pop in one of the videos that, you know, I found to show this. I just wanted to share it with you because if you had seen me haul this and were wondering, when is she going to show us how to do that? Well, here it is. <laughs> All right. I just wanted to do that little quick share. I hope you enjoyed it. And of course, you know, once you know how to do this, possibilities are endless for what you want to put inside. <laughs> All right. That's it for me this morning. Got to get ready for work. I hope you have a blessed day. Bye-bye.